This is the Amir brand, Superior Mini Digital Platform Scale. It's model I-2000. It's a digital scale. Um, pretty much well equipped. As it says on the box, it has a backlit display. Looks like it lights up in blue. It will automatically turn off in uh, 60 seconds. I believe that can be adjusted as well. It says it has a large platform and comes with two clear bulbs. I'm sorry, bowls. Uh, you can tear the reading on it by the full capacity and it's automatically calibrated or it's calibrated out of the box essentially. It takes two AAA batteries. Taking it out of the box, reveals the scale itself and batteries are included. Okay, here is the scale itself. I'll show you it up close here. Real shiny, real nice. The uh, two bowls that it's, uh, it comes with are right here. They are not cracked. It has that appearance to it. That's actually just a little clear plastic thing that you can peel off on there. We need to put the batteries in. That's right on the back side. The batteries, like I said, are included. So we'll just pop those in and close it up. And there we are. Hopefully you can read the display. It does read zero. Over here I have a package of Kerrygold uh, Reserve Cheddar. It says it is seven ounces. Now I don't know what it's currently set to. We'll find out in a moment. It says 207.5 and there's a little G in the display so that's grams. 7.32 ounces. Now is that exact? I don't know for certain. Um, the weight of the actual cheese itself is seven ounces. The packaging could certainly be the additional amount there. But I also do have, you see it goes back to zero and I'll show you these in a moment. This is a United States Quarter 2007 series. I don't know why it's reading 0.02 but we'll tear it and that reads 0 0.20 ounces. That's exactly what a US quarter is supposed to weigh. If we go back to grams, it says 5.4, and that's pretty close. I've read it's supposed to be 5.6, but that seems pretty close, especially for my needs. Now the units it says are grams, ounces, and I'm not a specialist on weights here, so we'll see. It says OZT, so I don't really know what that means. And DWT, I'm also not certain what that means. CT, I'm just not familiar with that. And GN. But we'll go back to grams for now. Now let's uh, show you the tear feature. Basically, here's one of the bowls, as they call it, that it comes with. We'll use actually the smaller one. And uh, when I put that on the scale, you can see that reads 21.8 grams. When you press tear, it's going to zero the scale. So then you can measure the quarter, and we should have the uh, reading that we got before. I'm actually going to switch over to ounces because we got a better measurement than that. So it says 0.77 with the bowl on there. We'll hit tear. It goes to zero. And if we put that in, exactly the 0.2 that we had before. This also has a counting function. Um, I don't have enough quarters on hand to show you this, but basically you can put, say, 25 of them if you want even in one of the little bowls here on the scale and set it using the PCS button right there for pieces. And when you do that, then you can add or remove the quarters and it will tell you how many pieces you have on there, which is actually pretty nice for coin counting and things like that. All in all, a pretty nice scale all around. 
You can power it off with the button right there. And that's really it. Just a nice little digital scale for measuring whatever you need to by a mirror. If you'd like to purchase this item, it's available for sale on Amazon. I'll include a link in the description for where you can find it. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you click like, make sure you click subscribe, and take care. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.